Hey guys, so I just really felt like making a video today. It's been a little while since I've made a video and I'm a little skeptical on making this video because it just came to me because of something weird that happened the other night and you gotta understand when it comes to paranormal type of things I don't I'm very very skeptical and I don't really believe in ghosts um I don't know why I don't I just I don't know whether because it scares me or whether it's because of my religious beliefs or what I'm just unsure. Very skeptical, like I said. Um, and, um, I mean, Hugo said he believes in, like, other... What? I don't want to quote him wrong, but he said something about he does believe in demons and he believes in different spirits and things like... Evil spirits can, you know, be around or something like that. Sorry, Hugo, if you're watching this and I said that wrong, but... I don't know, since we've talked about it before, um, uh, but I have had a few little tiny experiences that have made me go, hmm, at times, and they were noticeable enough that actually stick with me in my mind. Um, there are many times, uh, since I moved in with my family, where I felt someone touching me, and it wasn't like, I don't even know how to describe it. It's always like this, but it's like right here or on my shoulder, but most of the time it's like on my shoulder or my head, but most of the time I feel it in my head, and it's like a pressure but it's a very gentle pressure. It's not a threatening, malicious type of feeling. It's like very gentle, you know? And I've had that happen lots of times, but I kind of just discount it as like some weird body feeling or weird sensitivity that I have because my body is very sensitive. Um, and then when Draven was little, very small, um, like three months and up, uh, we would change him, you know, on a changing table, and he was always looking straight up at the ceiling, and he'd be laughing, and there was nothing funny going on, and I know babies laugh at random times and stuff, but he was just, like, focused on the ceiling, and he'd just laugh and laugh and laugh, and it was weird, it was just really weird. And then, um, the same thing happened in the bedroom one time. I was putting him to bed. This is over at the other apartment. And he just started laughing. And it was dark in the room, but he just started laughing. He's, like, looking toward the door and just cracking up. I'm like... Anyway, um... I got interrupted. Sorry, I'm talking quietly. It's just very difficult in this place. So I just want to quickly say something that happened the other night that was really weird. I was here in the living room, here on the couch by myself. And I was taking a photo of my new hair color. Um, it's hard to tell on camera, but it is red. A dark red. Um, and I was using the front-facing camera with a flash right over here by the closet. And if you can see, the, there's a closet right there. And then across the room by the front door, way over there, when I took the picture, it flashed and the diaper bag, backpack, purse thing that me and Dragon share, fell down flat and it wasn't like on the edge of anything it just fell down flat came crashing down and as soon as that happened in the closet I heard 
a noise because we have a fly swatter hanging up there and it started like scraping against the wall like it was swinging back and forth like someone knocked it and it wasn't the cats because this is up high hanging up and I was like how would that reaction of the backpack that fell down all the way across the room cause that to happen and I was just like it was just really really weird um, so that's just something I just felt like sharing. It's a strange thing that happened. I don't know if anything else strange is going to happen. Probably won't. But like I say again, I am extremely skeptical. Um, but there have been those little weird instances that happen. I don't know if they're coincidences or just weird feelings that I have. But anyway, I just felt like sharing that. Talk to you guys later.